Hi everyone, it's Miriam from Twinkle. Today we're going to be looking at lots of fun activities that you can do when using our Locating Countries of Europe map worksheet. So let's take a look. The resource can be used as an assessment tool at the start or end of a topic. At the beginning of the topic, the children can work in groups to answer the worksheet. And then at the end of the topic, maybe children can do it independently. Another way of using it as an assessment tool is to time children to see how long it takes them to locate the countries. They can compare their timing and the amount of countries they can locate from the beginning of the topic and then at the end. That way children can see their progress themselves. Get children learning fun facts about different European countries. They can learn about famous landmarks, the cuisines of the country, different rivers and natural features, the currencies and capital cities. There is so much they can learn about these countries. Children can learn this information through a variety of ways, whether it's a reading comprehension, a cookery lesson for a specific cuisine of a country, a maths lesson where children solve money problems using the currency of a country, or a geography lesson where children can learn about rivers and other natural features of a country. Why not create a large version of the Countries of Europe worksheet? This can be displayed in a classroom or at home. Using sticky notes, children can actively label the countries based on the key. In addition to this, you can get the children to colour in the flags of the Countries of Europe and stick them onto this map too. I hope you found these ideas useful and can use them when teaching children. Have a great day!